Hello there and welcome to another video by the MXQ project. So today's video is all about updating LibreLec using a tar file for the MXQ SL5 TV box, so one of these things. So this is the HD8 and Q version. This will also work for the M201D and of course the B-Link model of the MXQ box which has the button in the middle and the red stripe with the MX logo on the top. So we're going to be using a process called Samba to actually do this. All we're going to be doing is samba and using a PC into LibreLec. Find the update folder and simply drag and drop something called a tar file into that update folder. So this is going to save you from having to reinstall LibreLec every time KZAC releases the latest update. If you're actually upgrading from OpenLec to LibreLec, because KZAC used to do an open OpenLec build for the SL5, we're going to have to use a different tar file. It's very simple. I want to show you that very quickly through the tutorial. So let's move on to the first part. We're going to show you how to sample into LibreLec and find that tar file. The first thing we need to do is load LibreLec and head over to System Info where we're going to find the IP address. Make a note of that IP address because we're going to need it later. Next, head over to kzak.librelec.tv forward slash s five. And if you're open, updating for OpenLec to LibreLec, then to make it smoother, then you need to download one of these tar files appropriate to your hardware before proceeding to the latest version of LibreLec. If not, just head over to 8.0.1b, head into that file folder, and then update the appropriate .tar file for your hardware. So the HD8 and Q or the MXQ.tar or the M201D which was for the MXQs that shipped with half a gig of RAM. By now I'm sure you probably know which one's appropriate for your box. So download the appropriate tar file. And then next thing we need to do is any folder on your Windows desktop, open it up and as shown type in the IP address we collected collected before with two forward slashes in front of it as shown. Hit enter and then find the update folder which will be displayed amongst all lot of other folders. Click into, that, into the update folder and then all we need to do is drag and drop that .tar file we've downloaded just before into this folder. Grab it and drag it across. Now what will happen is it will start to copy the file and all we need to do is, once it's finished, just simply restart your MXQ box and it will install the update. There we have it, that's how to update LibreLec using tar files. So hopefully everything's went nice and smooth, smoothly for you and you're now running the latest version of KZAC's S805 LibreLec build. Now remember, if you're updating from OpenLec to LibreLec, don't forget to use the tar files that I showed you before, that are in the specific OE folder. Once you've done that, then you can update to the latest version of LibreLec because that version is running LibreLec 7 and we have the latest update which is LibreLec 8.0.1 which is running the latest version of Kodi Krypton 17.1 I hope you enjoyed this video if you did give me a thumbs up if you disliked it give me a dislike and we shall see you in the next video